Hello. Don't watch me. It's Jordan, and today is my birthday, and I got my hair cut. And today I'm going to cotton candy look. Using these are paint yeah, they're paint brushes. I know, but they're pretty much the same. Uh-uh. Just one spokes. No. So one... How is it the same? Because they're pretty much the same thickness. That's the same. Can we have the same hair? Okay. Well, today I'm going to be using the shimmer palette. The coastal sun. Whoa, oh, bright light! Mm, so, yeah. You're going to need this fluorescent. Red, and we're gonna substitute for. We're gonna use it as a fluorescent pink, and then you can either use that blue or this kind of blue up here. I think it was. Yeah, and this blue. And use whatever you want. I mean, this both, but both. yeah, this one, and then that. Pinkish reddish color because, like, it's more like pretty. Don't forget, it's pretty too. <laughs> okay. Next, you can just show me. <laughs> okay, so first thing you're going to do is you're going to take that pink color and again, you can get the magnet cut with a little brush and then this one. Sorry if I search up weird things. Oh, okay. Wait, what's this? It's a porn. Oh, pretty. You take the pink color and put it. Where is my? Did you use that one? Uh, I used that one today. Oh, it's the one I'm and talking about. That one, yeah, that one, and that one, and the yellow. Okay, so you're gonna take the pink color and put it in your inner corner, up to, you know, kind of close to the brow. Mm. Don't do it on that side. I have shimmer in my hair. Uh, how do I know? Okay, just don't try. Mm. Oh, you can do this. Okay, and What's do this beam skirt. Oh, wash. I'm going to do a lot of tutorials at my cousin's house. Just a lot of stuff. Cousin, would you like to say hi to all my fans? No. Okay. Okay, so. The one that goes in here the most is that one. I'm sorry. Well, it's blush, it's not blush. Ooh, Anyways, okay. So now you're gonna take the blue color that I showed you and you're going to apply to the outer corner up to the brow and you're gonna leave a little space because you're gonna put a kind of nylon y light color that I've done in the last tutorials. It's like that you use for highlighting, so yeah. These ones are pretty. One broke. I know. Hey, I want to. Too bad I can't keep it. I can order you one off Coastal Sense, so. <laughs> oh, really? If you like it, I can order it off Coastal Sense for you. Um, just like a hot pot. So it's just like one single thing on it, but it's really big. So if you find a color that you like, which would be surprising, right? Oh, it's very uneven. It's very weird. Okay, it's cotton candy. Of course it's going to look freaking weird, but there's some people out there who like cotton candy. So what you're going to do is you're going to take a nylon white, and I'm going to use a tanner white. But it's not tan. Like, I mean, this one up here. Right next to that yellow. I love that yellow. It will be in the next tutorial. Because I love it so much. They should come out with a hot pot on Coastal Sense for that. Oh, I just grabbed one! We'll be, we're going to use the 
I suggest using a diaper one for the ball of your eye. Not for the ball, but the ball of your eye. Turn, you're such a sick kid. Let it blend. Good. But, um, I then use the lighter color, the lighter white, for highlighting. No. Then I'm going to take the white, the lightest white. Do I put I'm going to highlight the brown. Mm. And then you can pile up with liner, but I love mine in my green. <gasps> oh, I'm not calling this cotton candy anymore. My fine green. It's a little light for that, but who cares? Anyway. Where's the lime green be? Okay. 